Alright everyone, um, this is a little sneak peek to me getting bangs in this vlog. I'm not going to talk about it, but <laughs> I have a little haul from Motel Rocks. I want to thank them for sponsoring today's video. I got a bunch of super cute pieces just in time for my trip because I'm literally about to leave. And these just came, so I'm very excited about them. They have a lot of great fall colors, patterns, everything you need. So I will have everything linked down below. And yeah, let's see what I got. The first item is something I'm really excited about, excited about because as you can tell, I love leather coats. And I've been searching for a green one for so long. So I found this long leather trench from Motel. And it's perfect, it has a little waist belt thing. It doesn't have a button, but it's good because it can like hold a lot under it and it's good for layering since it is pretty thin but i just think the olive color is stunning and i feel like a lot not a lot of people have green leather coats so i think that's cool too so i love that jacket so much the next item i picked out were these motel denim low-rise jeans because I just thought the fit on the model was cute. They're just super baggy, low rise, as you can tell. I think they'll just look fab with like so many things, honestly. So I can't wait to wear these. A little high rise shoe, or uh, platform shoe, a little low cut top, or sorry, not low cut, regular cut top. <laughs> but like, you know what I mean? Like not cropped, <laughs> long top. Uh, maybe like a high neck and then like this coat would be fire. The next item I'm also super obsessed with is this sweater. I'm very excited to wear this in Europe, London. It's just this like argyle kind of checkered print. It's like ivory and black and it's knit, it buttons up, it's perfect. I got this in a small. Um, it's in an extra small and I got the jacket in a small, I believe. Oh no, I got the jacket in an extra small in case you guys are wondering when you see the try-ons. But yeah, I love this so much and I can't wait to wear. Next thing I picked out is this long ass coat. It's like a wooly felt material. I got this in an extra small too. It's a houndstooth print. I just think this is super like old, like London classic look, like with a little hoodie underneath, just very simple. So I'm excited to wear this there. <laughs> it's cold as fuck, so I'm expecting this to be pretty warm since it's pretty long too. It feels pretty heavy duty. I have no idea how I'm gonna fit, my suitcase is already completely packed, so I have no idea how I'm gonna fit this stuff, but I'm excited to, regardless. The next piece is another jacket. It is this black leather bomber jacket, essential fall piece to have in your wardrobe. I have a couple black leather jackets, but I don't have any that like cinch the bottom like this. And I think bomber, bomber style, like this one is my only bomber style and it's brown. I think bomber styles are really the kind of jacket style this year. I think they're very flattering, easy to layer. So yeah, I love the color, just the zip down. I got this in a small, so yeah, love. So the next thing I got was this pantsuit with this, again, houndstooth print. This one's a bit of a wider houndstooth. Got these in an extra small pleated pants. Oh, love these, and they're thick, so I'm really excited to wear this. I feel like it'll be warm. And then a matching blazer. My boyfriend doesn't really like pantsuits for some reason. He just, like, is anti-pantsuit, but. Next, I just got this simple black mini skirt. I like it, because it's kind of like an A-line. It kind of goes out and is flowy. I actually didn't pack one a skirt like this, so this is actually perfect. And I got that in an extra small. And then the last item I have to show you guys is this little tank top. It's black with like lime green and white stripes. It is more of like a halter vibe with an open back. Kind of crosses at the chest. Super cute. Love this style of top. Um, and I got this in an extra small. So yeah, that's everything I got from Motel Rocks. Okay, so I quickly wanted to pop in here and just say that you guys also have a discount code for 25% off all the items until January 8th, and the code is RubyLynn25. I'll have it on the screen.
Thank you guys again for sponsoring this video. They have a ton of cute stuff, not just the stuff I showed you, but I think the stuff I showed you is pretty fucking good. So I urge you guys to go check out their website. I hope again, I will have all the links down below. And I hope you guys enjoy the rest of the vlog and make sure to follow me on Instagram because I will be posting in this stuff. Just you wait. Hello everyone, welcome back to a new vlog. Yay, I haven't said that in so long. I'm not gonna sit here and make excuses. I needed a break. Vlogging is very, I don't know. Maybe I've just like lost the natural instinct to vlog all the time, but because I also don't live alone, I'm not like gonna just sit here with my camera all day while like my boyfriend's sitting over here judging me. Not judging, but like I'm shy, even with my boyfriend, so. I think that's a big part of it, but I'm vlogging. It is Tuesday, or is it Wednesday? I don't even know, it's Tuesday. So it's basically gonna be a weekly vlog. It's Tuesday at like five o'clock, but I've just, I was watching some YouTube videos and it, it inspired me to vlog. So that's always great. Mm. Ow, um, just got water in my eye. It is getting very cold in New York, like extremely cold. Last night, I was, be like I didn't realize I could be that cold. I forgot I could be that cold. I was shivering, my teeth were chattering. Yeah, it was horrible. Like it's cold, cold here. Anyway, that's nothing new to me, as we all know. I'm from Canada. It's it very cold there too, but I'm just chilling right now. The apartment's a mess. I will show you in a second. I, what did I do today? I went to a beautiful low recipe hosted by Ella Rose, Lucy's sister. It was beautiful. We had lunch there. Um, super cool. They just launched this new product, which I'll grab. This bag. Sorry, it's a little dark. Anyway, got this cute purple puffer. And then... I got a cute little water bottle. I love water bottles. I was saying it's very, I'm very dry right now because the weather's changing. I think I'm getting a little sick from the cold and um, my skin is super dry. I'm super dehydrated, my lips, so I'm drinking a lot of water right now. So this is great, but their two new products they launched are the Plum Plump Hydrolonic, I don't know, did I say that right? <laughs> I'm sorry. High, high, hyaluronic, hyaluronic. I think I said that right. Hyaluronic cream, dewy moisturizer, and plump. Basically, they describe this as that one product you go to when your skin is just like acting out. And this is supposed to help. And my skin is most definitely acting out right now. Acting out, acting up. I literally can't speak. I need help. So I'm very excited to try this and I really like low recipe products because I don't know if you've tried them, but I find they're very just like dewy products. They're not too thick, not too light. Like I think they're just like a really good consistency. And what I really loved, they just showed us, this is not sponsored, but I just think it's really cool. They showed us it's like reusable packaging. So the actual like product is in this little thing and you can just like, when you finish this, you can keep the glass container and just rebuy the pod of product. I think that's so cool and environmentally friendly and I'd love to see it. Excited to try those. I really need to shower because my hair is disgusting right now. I've been feeling disgusting about it all day. So I'm gonna shower, wash my face and try those out later. But yeah, I'm just chilling. A couple updates for you guys. We have to be out of this apartment in two weeks. I was planning on trying to find an apartment. I don't know if I told you guys that or not. That's not happening anymore, it's too stressful. And I'm gonna be out of New York for at least two weeks anyway in December for the holidays. So I think what me and Luca are gonna do is travel for the whole month of December, which is very exciting. I'm definitely gonna vlog. If I don't vlog, literally like come for me in my DMs. Like that's not okay. I'm vlogging. Someone, if you guys could like remind me, I will be vlogging. I don't know where exactly we're going yet. I know for sure we're gonna be going to Italy to visit Luca's family, and then I'm gonna be going home for Christmas. I don't know if Luca's coming yet or not. 
but everywhere else is a little bit, we don't know exactly where yet, but planning on going December 1st. I'm very excited because I love to travel and it's a perfect opportunity, don't have an apartment. So yeah, we're gonna put all our shit in storage for the quadruple time this year. Yeah, I've just been unboxing some packages. I'll show you some PR I got today. Hair products. Honestly, I have no fucking clue how these people find my address. I, I guarantee, I, like, I know for a fact I did not respond to an email from them, so I don't know how this got here, but I'm very appreciative. I also got some Avene, I think that's how you say it, products, which is crazy because my mom used to like consider this like bougie. So I'm definitely gonna bring these home for her because she really likes that brand. And some Bliss products. Um, Pat McGrath sent their new palettes, which is very pretty. They are gorgeous looking. And then these gift sets from Youth to the People. And I already have these products, so I'm just trying to think of someone to give these to. Maybe one of you guys, but they're super cute. Really great idea for Christmas. And I just want to show you guys, this is the reality of getting so many packages a day. Um, yep, it's this. It's recycling. It's trash. That's not all of it. It's literally all of this. Thank God it's recycling day. But yeah, I get yelled at all the time for having so much shit. This is all me. Like, what a waste. Anyway, these are the boxes that we need to build because we're getting the fuck out of here. Those are our shoes. I don't know if I've ever really shown you. This is trash. I literally, this makes me look disgusting. I swear, we're not this gross. Usually it's clean. This box is all the leftover stuff from my closet sale, which I think I'm going to be donating or taking to Crossroads ASAP because I do not want to have any more clothes. This, oh God, it's so bad. This is all like fairly new stuff that I wanna take pictures in, but I've been on a very not confident vibe lately, so I have hated every the way I look and like everything. So yeah, no pictures have been being taken. I'm wearing my Monty's sweats. Okay, can you like fix yourself? What's going on here? Anyway, they're super cute, I love them. Thanks, Lexi. And um, this is my boyfriend's sweatshirt. There's a matching uh, hoodie to this. Right, oh my god, more shit everywhere. It's right here. I love the color. Oh no, I already stained it. I guess this is going to wash. <laughs> this is our laundry hamper. This is our full laundry. Oh my god, I'm really exposing myself right now. I'm watching Emma Leger. Or Emma Rose. I don't even know how to say her name. Anyway, fellow Canadian. And I'm eating some pasta penne alla vodka because I was really craving it and it's really fire and dealing with mess <laughs> I have to turn that off because copyright, but hello, it's been like a couple days. Um, honestly, I haven't really been leaving the house much. I'm listening to Adele's new album, Ear. I'm texting Lucy right now because we're literally really pissed off because the stupid place where we did the closet sale, if you know, is not paying us our money. <laughs> and they're being really really sus and just like not cool not cute either it's not a good look but i have so much to do i'm sorry i keep looking at myself looking at you <laughs> basically i am packing because we are moving to a storage unit on the 25th and revolve sent these Lovely, lovely flowers. Look how pretty they are. They're literally so cute. So thank you, Revolve. I also want to show you guys some things I got from Revolve. I'm actually, I'm not even gonna speak through it. We're not gonna do a whole haul because that's too much. I got a bunch of new things from Revolve and I'm gonna insert a little clip haul. Um, for just some clips I took for TikTok. But a lot of cute stuff. I'm drinking some emergency vitamin C because Luca's been sick and I don't want to get sick before we travel so I'm getting my vitamin C and but yeah I got some Revolve stuff I will link them all down below 
And I also wanted to say that their ambassador program is now open to literally anybody. You could have 200K, I mean, sorry, <laughs> you could have 2K to 200K or more, whatever. But yeah, you guys can sign up. It comes with a ton of amazing opportunities. You guys probably all know, like Revolve does trips, Revolve have, does a lot of gifting, sends me flowers. So they're a really great fam. And um, I recommend you guys all sign up if you guys are interested. But yeah, I'll leave the link for that as well as the links to my favorites. I have a lot of cute stuff in there as well that I will be purchasing, but I can't buy anything right now because I'm trying to sell everything. So if you guys want, check out my Depop because I'm trying to sell my whole life right now. Because I don't want to put all my shit in storage. I'm over it. I just want to like, I'm really trying to get rid of stuff and become a minimalist, even though it's not really happening. But this is honestly pretty good. Two boxes and it's pretty much all my clothes. Okay, ignore the messy bedroom. This is like all I have left in my closet. This actually looks like a lot. And I have all my shoes still. These are all my shoes. So I have to pack those still. But all of this is stuff I might be bringing on our trip. But I have to filter through still. But like all the bins are pretty much empty. I only have like a couple pants down there. And then same with these. They just little shirts that I might bring. This I still need to go through, but whatever. Yeah. But I think right now I'm going to get ready. Also, I got this from TikTok. And let me tell you guys. Okay, I'm not going to show you my teeth right now, but this stuff works so well. It's kind of expensive. It's like $70 or something like that. But like, I don't really remember how much the white strips are. I think they're like 50. But this is only, you only have to do this 10 times. And I swear my teeth are like 10 times whiter. So I'll update you guys once I've done 10 days. To be honest, I've only done one day, so. But I already can tell my teeth are whiter. Like my teeth are yellow. I drink a lot of coffee. So they're like, what are they called? Crest 3D white strips with light dental whitening. I don't fucking know. Anyway, I'll link a down below I got it on Amazon. But I got it because of a TikTok and I literally immediately bought it. My bathroom's a mess. But I thought I would show you guys my recent skin. Okay, I also have pimple patches like all over my face. <laughs> my skin is going through it. Also, someone commented Ruby should get her eyebrows done. Should be 10 times prettier. Please tell me because like this is my natural eyebrow. It's like sparse and disgusting. I was like considering like microblading, but I just like, I'm scared. So I think I might just like get an eyebrow serum, let them grow a little bit, and then go get them done, just because I feel like they're so thin. I don't know what somebody would do. Like, there's really not much to do. I don't know. Can someone please, like, send me some tutorial or something? Like, am I supposed to brush up and then trim? Like, I don't know what to do. I don't know how to do eyebrows. So they're just kind of there. And, like, I try to fill them in. But that's all. Anyway. I'm going to say it once. And I've already said it a million times. These are the best best acne pimple patches they're the cores x ones i get them on amazon i will link them as well they're the best the best the best i have tried every single one this one actually brings out shit and like brings your pimple to like a head if it's like deep under there it's just like yeah it's just good it gets out of the gunk and the oil and bleh, bleh, bleh. yeah it's the best i literally go through them i need to order some more so i'm stocked up for my trip because i use these shits like all the time Anyway, that's that. I need to get ready. I need to film some stories for uh, sponsorship. I want to film a thrift haul before I pack all this shit up that I got from Canada, but I keep saying that and I never do it. Uh, I'm so excited to travel though. I'm really excited. Tomorrow we're going to New Orleans. I'll bring you guys. Basically, Luba needs to get his passport renewed. I feel like we need to change up the location. I've been here for a while. <laughs> I'm like swatting around the house. So basically, um, Luca, his passport is expired. And since America is like, I don't fucking know, the worst. There's like, you have to make an appointment to go get your passport renewed. And so the only appointment is, was in Honolulu, Hawaii or <laughs> New Orleans. So he took the New Orleans one, and basically he can't go anywhere without if he doesn't get his password renewed, so we have to go. I've never been. I'm kind of excited. We're going to have, like, a nice meal. I have to book our flight for that. <laughs> yeah, I have to do that now. But, 
year. And then we come back and then we leave on the 25th and then we're out. We're going to London first. I'm very excited. I wanna go shopping. But yeah, okay, so I'm gonna do some stuff and then I'll see you guys in a bit. This vlog has not been very interesting so far. I'm so sorry, it's just been me talking. But I hope you guys don't mind that. I'm in a kind of good mood right now. It's not very often. So. Also, I'm not sure if I ever showed you guys my carpet. It was like over there before, but look how cute it is. If it's still available, I can try and link it down below, but it's so cute. I love it. I got a new one, but I haven't even unraveled it because obviously there's no point. So I'm about to film a thrift haul with pretty much everything in here. I think there's some stuff of mine at the bottom. But I thrifted this all in Canada when I went home. And I'm now finally filming it. So I don't even remember what's in this box. I'm excited to go through it. say it in Niyuki boots, Maharashi's, Ibisu, Brandy, um, jewelry. Yep, that's that. This is the name of the place we went to. It's called Mujin this morning. It was pretty good. It was quite stressful getting over here. We had to run to the post office to print some things and like it was just a mess. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go a coffee shop do some emails and answer some dms until he's done and then we leave tonight at six i think there's some more spots we want to try and eat at I'm gonna do a food tour or something today but yeah I had a horrible sleep last night but i'm okay because i had coffee we're at the aquarium i don't know where Luca's going So oh. 
so I don't be 